today we're going to go out and do some lazy eights. Lazy eights are a commercial maneuver. Uh, basically, it's a 180 degree turn, uh, climbing on the first half of it, uh, and then on the final 90 degrees half of it, descending back down. And when we basically get to 180 degree point, we should be within a plus or minus 100 feet of altitude and plus or minus 10 um, miles per hour in terms of airspeed and 10 degrees plus or minus 10 degrees on the heading. We're going to go do that and demonstrate how to do those. All right, got a little bit of crosswind here today of the north northwest. Here we go. Mixture primer locked. Engine gauge is in the green. Airspeed's coming alive. We're up. Alright, we're going to climb to 3,000 feet to do these maneuvers. So I find performing these maneuvers starting on a cardinal heading such as north, uh, south, and west or east is a much better way to, to go. Uh, just easier to keep track of uh, where you're going to roll out at. Uh, I think we'll move to the east a little bit, away from these hills here. A little bit breezy out here today. They did say some moderate turbulence. Wow, it's November 20th today, and I see a couple boats out there having a good time still. All right, so we're going to do a pre-maneuvering check. So I want to do this maneuver at cruising speed here. I'm going to use about 2,200 RPMs. So just do a quick another turn back just for a second for um, checking what's behind me since we're going to be doing 180 returns. All right, we look good there. We'll come back. So this is called lazy eights. Basically what we want to do is be doing climbing turns um, to a 90 degree point and then descending back down as so we complete a 180 degree turn. Basically you want to have frankly constant movement. Uh, there should be really no kind of step type motion here. It should be constantly fluid movement. Uh, we're going to start off by pitching up with a little bank angle. We're going to get to a 45 degree point. We should be at max pitch. And we're going to continue to bank over to 30 degrees. At our 90 degree point, we should be level pitch and max bank of 30. We'll let the nose kind of slice down through um, to start a negative pitch. And once we get to a 135 degree angle, we will start the wings roll out. And we should roll out um, at uh, the reciprocal heading, which is going to be uh, one, uh, two, seven. And it's basically the same airspeed and the same altitude. Got the traffic support zero, 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 turning crosswind three five. Let me get in my heading of east here. And with that, I think we'll begin. So we're gonna just keep our power setting roughly the same. We got about 22, 2300. So I'm gonna pitch up with just a little bit of bank. I got a 45 degree point out here, and then I've got a 90 degree point. Already turn base one four. When I get to my 45 degree point, I should be max pitch, and I should start to go more toward 30 degrees of bank, and then letting the nose come down. Negative pitch from 90 to 135. When I get to my 135 point, I start to roll out. Up a trolley, taking runway 26, Laconia. And then we roll out at 2.7 here. We're going to go right back and do it again on the other way to the right. We're going to pitch up with a little bit of bank. My 45 degree point, I'm the max pitch. I'm going to let the bank continue over to 30 degrees. My 90 degree point, I'm letting the nose come down. Enter a... Uh the nose is negative pitch here. One thirty five, we're going to start my rollout. Laconia traffic, code 838, uh, left downwind. And my airspeed's a little fast there. 
a little bit started about 3100 so I'll roll out that heading at 090 air speeds a little bit quicker than it, when I started so a little bit of steeper descent we'll do another couple I'm going to start one to the right this time All right, we're going to get another 090 heading makes it easier we're 3100 feet here power set to good cruise by 2200 okay. So I'm going to pitch up with just a little bit of bank. I got my 45 over at this lake. And here, my 45, I'm rolling over to 30 degrees of bank. Letting that nose start to slice down. By 135, I'll start the rollout. And there's my 27 heading, 3100. Airspeed got a little quick again, but not too bad. I'm going to do right to the left here, again about 3100, about 100. Knots. We're pitching up with just a little bit of bank. Our 45 degree point, we'll let the bank continue, but we'll relax the pitch. There's our 30 degrees of bank. Coming back down. Here's speed back to where it was, the altitude where it was. You can be more aggressive if you like, um, but you really should stay about 5-10 knots above stall speed at your uh, peak height. So those are Lazy 8s. Hopefully that helped show you how to do the Lazy 8s. If they did, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell for the next video that I come out with.